Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to yet another video. Thank you so much for tuning in. I very much welcome. My name is Pidile. For those who are new, thank you so much for coming to Pidile Pablo's Entertainment. Kindly like the video, subscribe to the channel if you still haven't until today. Please do subscribe, okay? So thank you very, very much. Now, guys, I want to talk about Uitu Melong Bukaba because, yeah, there's a video that I. Uh, I uploaded on my channel, like I told me about talking about the history, the notas. So remember, notas we've seen Unota going up and down on my podcast, but we told me long about she was, she didn't speak that much. But there was a particular video that was I think it was nine minutes long, something like that. She was talking about this thing, you guys. <clears throat> so I think they are talking about uh, on the story. They are talking about how that video can just put her into trouble. Remember, she sued a uh, Unota Baloi for airing her and all that. So the matter is now in court. So when I see Nota going around my podcast, I always said, I wish you can just keep quiet, my brother. Do I know you are around on the podcast and saying a lot? Let us just hope I was fucking king. And this is me just to Nota, you know. But then I saw her also talking. About, I'm like, these guys are just around talking about each other. Isn't this matter in court? Why can't they keep quiet and just a little and then they can start paperizing after? Because they paperize too much. Less was Kadibabo Pisen, something like that. You know what I mean? So, but, anyways, it is what it is, you guys. On the story here on Sunday, what they're talking about, how that video could learn her into trouble. Itumela Bukaba has been informed that if it turns out that she broke the protection order, she will be arrested. Inga kongi shongiti, ubo pisa samwa, kuna ma protection order and all, but we are preparing too much. You're supposed to keep quiet and lay low until this matter is over and done with. But ah, okay, she actually recorded a video. She said that she was just saying a lot, a lot. Yeah, for me, it was like, ay, get humola, man. Ay, <laughs> but anyways, actress and singer would Meleng Bukaba, who is accusing Nota, Nota Nlamulova Loi of airing her, might find herself in hot water after allegedly violating a protection order. Bukaba appeared at the Randbeck Family Court on Monday. According to the protection order that uh, Sunday World have seen, Bukaba was due to appear in the court on Monday to give Give reasons why the interim order should not be um, should not be made final. I think so. Uh, that is what is on that story. No, Nota stated that. Let me see you guys. Yes, uh, Nota stated that he has requested that uh, his attorney examine the video because he believes she might have broken the protection order, which prohibits her from discussing him on social media. But doesn't Nota not discuss her? That's why it's about two level babil. Her attorney will submit pleadings um, to prevent the enforcement of a pre uh, provisionally extended permanent protection order until the case is heard. Now that video, they are talking about that nine minute video. Like I said, according to the protection order, Ubukaba is not allowed to post anything about Nota on social media or get in touch with him anyway. Unota asked his attorney to watch the nine-minute video she uploaded in which she pleaded poverty and claimed that prosecutors might conclude there was no case because there was insufficient evidence to prove the allegation beyond uh, a reasonable doubt or that the defense had bribed him. Yeah, she's talk about a lot of things. She's saying, yeah, money mustn't be involved. There mustn't be homo like Meleng. <laughs> You guys, like, really? The case has been rescheduled uh, for October 22nd in order to give Ubukaba more time to find legal counsel. She was informed that if it turned out that she had broken the protection order, she would be arrested. The Randberg Magistrate Court granted Ubaloi, who had spent uh, the previous weekend in custody, 5,000 rands bail uh, last Monday. So, yeah, I mean, you guys, the case against Unota was rescheduled for November 9 in order to verify. <coughs> So they were in order to verify the WhatsApp messages uh, between him and Uitu Melengukaba, Nota was told not to get in touch with the complainant at all. In a Sunday World interview last week, a contentious music executive revealed that his RAP case was a setup. So according to him, he thinks the messages claiming to be from him were sent after he had gone to sleep. So they were sent with his phone, pretending to be him, something like that. I could see since at it's a setup, which means like when you're sleeping, then someone takes your phone maybe and send messages to to, to themselves or whatever. Good reward. It's just a whole lot. For me, they must just keep quiet. They are preparing. I'm not talking about podcast. He went to Coco's Cotton. He went to um, Promise Makunyane. He went where else. I've seen him. I'm like, not... Uh, 
But anyways, uh, get to it. now this is it. Too long, book. I'm going to a nine-minute video. Okay, girl, if they can find out that you broke the rules of that protection order, you will be arrested. With last one, I not. both of you will be in trouble. Why any cool maga cool? Nobody will be saying. Just keep quiet until this matter is over and done with. That's me. But anyways, they keep talking and talking. But <laughs> what can we do, you guys? This is uh the story. So get to long, book. I'm about to girl could have put herself into trouble there because going a protection order i do not know you guys it is what it is thank you so much for watching this particular one like it subscribe share and then i'll meet again on the next upload bye